How are you, dear children? Are you all fine? Children, are there any such people in your friend circle who unnecessarily create troubles for others? Children, this is very wrong. This habit can be very wrong in life. If you misuse your powers on the younger ones, then one day the same will happen to you. That's why one should never disturb the younger ones unnecessarily. Let me explain this to you through this one story. Now listen to it very carefully. Once upon a time there was a rosewood tree in a big forest. A snake used to live in a burrow under that tree. That snake was very cunning. He used to eat the frogs living in the nearby pond and the birds sitting on the trees. That snake was so clever that he used to sleep during the day and make its prey by going underfoot in the dark of night. Time passed. Snake grew bigger and fatter. That snake became so big and fat that it had difficulty in entering its own burrow. The snake thought that now he would have to change its place. Now the snake started wandering here and there in search of his new home. Only then he saw a big banyan tree. On that banyan tree there was many kind of small creatures who used to live there. And under the same tree ants also used to live. They had made a small hill of their own. The snake came near the tree and said to the rest of the creatures, "From now on, I will live on this tree only." You all have to go from this tree. Go and vacate this tree right now for me. The animals and birds living on that banyan tree got scared. But the ants living under the tree didn't mind at all. Those ants had made a small mud hill with great effort for their living. The snake saw that the ants ignored his words. He came nearby and said, Hey the ants did not listen i have already asked to vacate the space right now the ants thought that this snake is very arrogant it is not going to agree if explained so he should be taught a lesson right now all the ants united and then together they moved towards the snake the ants surrounded the snake and they started biting him the snake was in great pain and ran away screaming after that he never came back there so because of the solidarity of the ants all the animals returned to the banyan tree and started living happily there again so children how did you like this story children This story gives us a lesson that we should never misuse our powers. One should never disturb others unnecessarily on the basis of anyone's power. Just like the snake was doing. Those who do this, one day they themselves suffer the consequences. Have you understood children? So children, now I'm going. I will come again next time with another fun story for you all. Bye bye